Motel. I, you know what? I got a taste for some chicken. Oh, Lord. Well, speaking of chicken. Yeah. We're going to talk about it. I got, some, I got a taste for some chicken today. I feel like chicken tonight. <laughs> like chicken tonight. Like chicken tonight. Well, I'm going to tell you a secret, Maddie. Come on. I, I if like you want secret. chicken, don't go here. Where? And who could forget about this incident? An inspector forced an employee to throw away food at the crispy, crunchy chicken inside the Chevron on Fulton Industrial in Atlanta. This after rats were seen roaming around the kitchen area. How many rats do you have here? Like 10, 15, some... 10 to 15 rats here? Like this, sometimes. And they're getting into the food? The store was forced to stop food sales and then temporarily shut down to get rid of the rat. He said sometimes. Bro. <laughs> This man said 10 <laughs> to 15 rats sometimes. <laughs> so that means one or two of the rats has been deep fried. <laughs> what really what really had me for all was that it was in Georgia. Mo Fulton Industrial. <laughs> Mo, you got to really understand that that crispy crunchy chicken is something major. <laughs> That crispy, crunchy chicken is something serious. Oh, my goodness. Well, I done ate. I actually have sat on live with y'all and have <laughs> ate crispy, crunchy chicken from the fucking gas station. That's why when I saw this, I was so weak. So I said, it's just giving exotic meats. I'm like, Lord, it ain't even bok choy no more. <laughs> it's American Deli. <laughs> God, it ain't even bok choy no more. You see, I can't even trust restaurants no more. I know, Mo. You ain't supposed to trust them anyway, Mo. Listen, let me tell y'all something. You know when you go out to eat, you're supposed to go in there. You're supposed to go in there. If you make it home <laughs> from the restaurant, or you make it through your life, and you don't ate out at so many restaurants, uh -huh. you need to be doing this right now while I speak right now. You need to be getting up right now, honey. And doing and, what? And doing this right here. Yeah. Y'all need to be doing that right there. Oh. If you done survived all the time, I eat at a restaurant because you best believe that them people that's in them restaurant, they know how many rats run around <laughs> in that bitch because they done counted them because they couldn't catch them bitches. This man said about 15. About 10, 10 15, 15 sometimes. Sometimes? I'm well, like, what? How, do you, how can you casually just be on TV saying, yeah, I have like about 10, 15. Maybe sometimes. about 10, 15 of them there. <laughs> You know, one or two of them are fed in the grease. We don't have to clean the grease side. And we didn't let the rat go to waste. No, we did. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, my goodness. No, you see. Mm -mm. You said get somebody else to do it, Mo. Get somebody else to do it. Get somebody else to do it. When you were and telling me, when we were in Cali, you were like, Oh, we just had bok choy. I was like, don't tell me that. Man. I'm always saying it. Anytime like, don't it, tell me that. Listen, and the way that meat came down, that damn steak meat <laughs> came down, I was like, I said, Mo, I just want to let you know, this is bok choy right here. And I was like, you lied. Cut you it out. You I lied told to me. The lady. Because you said it was chicken. I did. You told me it was chicken. I said, it's bok choy, Mo. <laughs> I told the lady. The lady didn't understand what I was saying. I said, she said, would that be honest? I said, cut it up. <laughs> Y'all remember me telling y'all that shit? Listen, just listen. We know the people, the people had that shit in the soup the last time we talked about some shit like this. Mm. And I said, they couldn't even cut it up. Cut it up! <laughs> Why don't you just take it and dice it? <laughs> cut it up! Damn, fool a bitch. Oh, my goodness. They said, Maddie, play the video. Again. Which one? Do you want me to play the video about the man? Play the, play the news video, Mo. All right. And who could forget about this incident? 
An inspector forced an employee to throw away food at the crispy, crunchy chicken inside the Chevron on Fulton Industrial in Atlanta. This after rats were seen roaming around the kitchen area. How many rats do you have here? Like 10, 15, some... 10 to 15 rats here? Like this, sometimes. And they're getting into the food? The store was forced to stop food sales and then temporarily shut down to get rid of the rat. My thing Nigga, is do you see them hoes back there looking at the camera? Right, they were chilling, man. Them rats was back. The camera came in and found them. At <laughs> least, what's this, what y'all not really grasping about this? <laughs> is the chilling. camera? It didn't even take the people. It didn't take them no time to find the rat. They were, no. <laughs> them hoes were back there looking. <laughs> you know, if you notice, they just had the camera looking through a hole, <laughs> looking through a doorway. <laughs> They just had the camera looking through the door and see you just saw rats. <laughs> oh. Nah. Just embarrassed the people. Like, nah, I told y'all to go back there and sit down. We was having inspections today. I know when they left that stuff. You brought that white bitch to my buzzer. <laughs> Branches. <laughs> And why was the man looking like, oh, this is normal? Like, he was like, oh, no, this is normal. No, listen There's to nothing me. wrong with this. He, that people left that store, that man with me, that say, Patches, you brought that white bitch to my bottom. You are dumb. <laughs> you are dumb. Maddie, if you look at the video again, if you look at the beginning where that woman was throwing away that chicken, you look at, look at her. You could tell she was upset she was throwing away that chicken. Yes. She was upset she was throwing away that chicken. She was like, I, I slave. I done cooked these- this chicken out there. You, I told you motherfuckers to go back there and sit down. They, back there, they like bad children. Bro, we got to watch it one more time. <laughs> and who could forget about this incident? An inspector forced an employee to throw away food at the crispy, crunchy chicken inside the Chevron on Fulton Industrial in Atlanta. This after rats were seen roaming around the kitchen area. How many rats do you have here? Like 10, 15, some 10 to 15 rats here? Like this, sometimes. And they're getting into the food? The store was forced to stop food sales and then temporarily shut down to get rid of the rat. Look, you see the bitch? There was a rat in the cage. And look here. Maddie, there was I did not notice that. There was a rat in the cage. That wasn't the cage, bro. That was the that was the basket what you dropped. Oh the hell in. no. Oh hell no. Oh, hell no. Nah. I thought that was a cage. I'm telling you, they went back there and said, Precious! <laughs> <laughs> you a dummy, bitch! You brought that white bitch to my mother! Bro. <laughs> That's just how some of y'all hoes roaches be in y'all house. <laughs> That's, how... That's how some of y'all hoes roaches be. Don't, act like... Don't judge them people. Don't you dare judge them people <laughs> when y'all know That's how some of y'all roaches be. <laughs> Motherfucker be coming to your house. You see one roach coming. Then you see them marching their kids across the floor. That's normal for y'all hoes. I've been in some houses where you be like, you know, I don't even want to take off my shoes. Bro, I'm going to leave my shoes on. Bro, the damn show ain't this one. <laughs> the motherfucker roaches crawling across. You looking like, wait, you don't see that roach? Oh, child, they over there, girl. No, man. <laughs> Use a dummy, bitch. <laughs> Mo, I can't ever eat, and I'm and as, as good as that crispy crunchy chicken be. <laughs> it's fucked up. You see, I, I can't eat ga- gas station food no more. I'm not gonna sit up and tell you no lie. We just ate bok choy, Mo. We hey, did, you, we, but I, I unknowingly, we, we go on a road trip, we're gonna pull over and get some crispy crunchy chicken. <laughs> No, we not. <laughs> we did. No, we not. Oh, what man. you gonna eat a honey bun? Yeah, I'll, I'll take that. You a trust a honey bun? Oh shit, I don't. Do- wait, what's wrong with a honey bun? Okay, wait. Mo, hold on, you don't see me. how that shit? Them people, what be going on in them factories? <sighs> when they be wrapping that food up? Mo, you just got to cook your shit and put it in your own stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna bring me a lunchbox. <laughs> I'm gonna start bringing me a lunchbox whenever we travel, Maddie. I'm bringing a lunchbox. <laughs> well, bitch, get ready because we travel in a couple of days. <laughs> And so you bring your lunch box because I'm there. So pull it up and say, All right, my line to the picture the waitress is gonna be cut it up. (laughs) (laughs) 
So it said Ratatouille 2, Adventures in Atlanta. <laughs> full to the, you know, full, you know what's over there, full to the dust <laughs> It's a oh. lot of niggas over there, full to the dust They done, A lot of niggas probably watched the news station and said, damn, we just got a whole eight piece yesterday. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what did, Cause that Christmas, now listen, the, be honest. Okay. I need y'all in the comments to be honest. Be honest in the comments. Mm-hmm. How many of y'all have ate the crispy crunchy chicken? <laughs> <laughs> no, be specific. Be specific. How many of y'all ate the crispy crunchy chicken or from full to the industrial? <laughs> be honest. If you live here in Atlanta, how many of y'all that had the crispy? Tammy, you got your hands up. Tammy got her hands up. <laughs> So I know you are gagging. <laughs> Cause bitch, just as sure as they get this one over here behind my house, I'm gonna gag. <laughs> Maddie, if you if you go there one day and you see caution tape all around, I'ma already know. I'm just gonna tell my friend up there. I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna tell uh uh Jeffrey Patel. <laughs> Mr. Patel, cut it up. <laughs> Oh, okay. Everybody say never. Tammy said she done ate her. Yeah, some people said they ate them. Hold on, wait. Oh, no. They say, uh, they, uh, you say it was always dry when you seen it. Uh, uh you in Kansas? Okay, well, shit. There's one in Kansas. They, got them in Kansas. they got them at the truck stops. Oh, the crispy crunch. Camilla said the other day. Ah! <laughs> Girl, you not know that shit. That was some good. It was good with some hot sauce and honey, Girl, baby. Ooh, ooh, my God! It's so good. Tabasco. Ooh, some good with some hot sauce no, and no, honey. Not Tabasco. It's be the the hot sauce packets that they be giving. The, the one that from listen. <laughs> oh, and let's talk. Listen, listen to me, y'all. Listen very. Put your ear to the screen. If you don't ate at church's chicken, <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> Ain't no video footage from Church's Chicken that I don't want to implement Church's Chicken in. <laughs> but I guarantee you, cut it up. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Thank God I haven't had churches in a while. Baby, but Mo, don't act like you don't be, you don't have Church's Chicken. You'd be like, this ain't right. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, you got to be honest with yourself. And say that you done been out eating some shit. You've been eating this stuff. You've been telling yourself why you eat it like this ain't right. It don't taste, it don't taste like regular. Like chicken. this ain't right. Mo, just eat it like this is not right. This ain't right, man. I'm not gonna lie. I've had some chicken where I'm like, you know what? That this ain't right. Yeah, I, I need to wash this down with something. <laughs> uh, uh, a brown soda. <laughs> I don't even want a sprite. Give me a coke. Because Coke will burn up anything. <laughs> You drink a Coca, you pour Coca Cola or anything, it's gonna ask it, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna eat that shit up, <laughs> bitch. I'm telling you, we it, we all got to tell the truth that we done been out eating somewhere and we've had food and it's been and we've eaten it and it, it just like this is not right. There's That's something true. that my spirit is telling me that there's something that is not correct about <laughs> this entree. Hansel, Hansel said. Churches is good and it's economical. <laughs> economical. <laughs> chicken is blessed. <laughs> Listen, every time, every year I survive churches, I'm telling you. It's all about, 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 Go away! You better be doing that every time you survive one of your outings. Anybody that don't cook at home, which is me. So it said McDonald's Sprite be spicy as fuck. Oh, let me tell you something. And we're not even going to bring McDonald's into this. <laughs> Girl, we're not even to bring McDonald's into this. Because just as sure as you had a double, a, a quarter pounder, a Big Mac with DLTs, just as sure as you had anything, chicken nut, if just as sure as you've had any of that from, from McDonald's, you have consumed 
something outside of the norm. <laughs> yes, you have. I'm just First of you... all, they cheese don't milk. <laughs> Neither does the meat. <laughs> I just want y'all to know <laughs> that it, while we sit up here judging crispy, crunchy chicken, <laughs> if you eat McDonald's, you have to be in the judgment-free zone. <laughs> You got to. You got to let them all off with a warning. <laughs> you got to let those people off with a warning because, nigga. Oh, nigga. They get away with a warning because, nigga. <laughs> McDonald's. McDonald's? They feed you everything. <laughs> McDonald's feed you everything. McDonald's? Oh, girl. You know how you can make a beef, a, a, a hamburger out of, of black peas? <laughs> <laughs> at least you know you eat protein at McDonald's. <laughs> at least you know at McDonald's you're eating protein. You eat. It just depends on what kind of protein right. you eat. You know, I mean, excuse me, at least at Crispy Crunchy Chicken you eat protein. At McDonald's you eat plastic, <laughs> biodegradable shit. <laughs> You eat paper bag, whatever it is, they can, whatever it is they can grind up and make it to a small patty. No, really, plastic bags, Maddie. No, you're not. You got to re- You got to do. I'm telling you, you have. Now, I know to, they. I know they chicken tenders, Maddie. They just throw the whole thing in. Oh, listen to me. If you do, if you watch those things on uh, those documentaries on these things. You wouldn't eat anywhere out. Oh, really? How the food is prepped, how this is done, how that is. You wouldn't eat out anywhere. So it said, so it said, so it said McDonald's is biodegradable. They, they said T.S. Bell has been sued. By well, I mean, we all know. I didn't say I was going to stop eating. I didn't tell nobody to stop eating because just to show us I won't be a Big Mac or I won't be a double quarter pounder or if I want me a motherfucking set of chicken, I'll put a, I know I'm going to be eating a piece of plastic. But Maddie, did you see the video of somebody put a McDonald's burger inside of a, a, a safe? And they brought it out like two, three years later. Yes. And it looked exactly the same. Just like the commercial. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, ma'am. <laughs> Mr. Rex, Mr. put Mr. Rex coming up there. This is what I said last week when I was talking. If you eat any Golden Walk, China City, China Town, China Walk, Chinese is red, dragon, anything. Don't even come from McDonald's or church. <laughs> all I tell you, all those places, cut it up. But do you, Madison, but it does make sense. When when we be going through like food shortages, there's certain places that don't run out of food. Never. Never. And never will. <laughs> all those missing persons that be going through. <laughs> Mo, those slew of missing people. Really, Betty? Shit. <laughs> Shit. Oh. Okay, allegedly. Allegedly, okay. right. But I'm going to pull up on that. Can I have a two piece finger and cheese, please? <laughs> Can I have a Mac Cuban rib? Mac Cuban rib. Oh, that's, that's why the McRib be seasonal. <laughs> That's why the McRib is on as a seasonal thing. You got to watch those restaurants that got those seasonal things. So you be like, oh, okay. <laughs> we out of that. We out of that right now. Right we, now? we got to wait on we got to wait on a new shipment of human. Oh. <laughs> 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 so I don't know if I'm gonna really judge that restaurant. I just say they, they just need to go there and put the rest in the back. <laughs> Cause once the motherfuckers in there, they in there. They ain't going nowhere. Once the motherfucker rats and shit is in them in a building or something, they in that bitch. Ain't no coming up out of there. Yeah, they they obviously say you know what? <laughs> somebody put the big rib is back. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I mean, shit, we ain't lying. At least we not, hold on now. At least we not sitting up here being delusional. Like, oh, that's, oh, that's beef. My head hurt. Ain't enough cows next to McDonald's. <laughs> But them up, you ain't heard them say in a long time. Two all beef patties, special sauce, lettuce, oh. cheese, pickle, onion on a sesame bun. We ain't heard that since the eighties. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. We ain't commit their commercials have changed. They have changed. <laughs> when Aretha was singing for da, 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 when Patty with the was singing for the breakfast, ah, it all those commercials. You don't even see them doing that no more. No, no, because they they drifted away from that. You know all they. All they be really pushing is they french fry. <laughs> now, I'm not going to lie to you. They french fries be busting. The best ones. They french fries be busting. Nah, they, I'm telling you, bro. <laughs> that's all you see is them pushing they french fries. <laughs> so, look. Uh, the parking lot before when the club let out. That's yeah, true. Straight up. That's true. They done this ain't going nowhere. That's why they be open 24-7. Yeah. That motherfucker, how you how you got that much meat 24 hours a day? Uh-uh. <laughs> Imagine. They don't run out of food, but that's that 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 ice cream machine never worked. It never worked. Cause all that mold and shit be in there. But guess what I'm gonna do when I pull up there this week? Cause I'm what? going to McDonald's this week. Can I have a, a vanilla cone, please? <laughs> Sometimes in life, you just got to take a gamble. <laughs> well, then that definitely means the ice cream ain't real. <laughs> oh, the ice cream real. You sure? Mo. Now, the fungus that come along with it real, too. <laughs> oh. oh, so it's that finger and cheese. Listen, listen to me, y'all. It, we, you could be driving in a desolate place. You'll find a McDonald's. And you can look to the right, and there's a McDonald's. There's there a golden McDonald's. arches. <laughs> you could be in driving in a desolate, desolate place. Because I have driven across the country. I have driven across the country. I've driven, I, I've driven to New York, Los Angeles. I've driven everywhere, everywhere. And every time when we couldn't find anything Food. else. There was a McDonald's. You look to the left. Or to the right, there is a McDonald's there. <laughs> oh. Am I tell me am I lying? <coughs> tell me am I lying? Because I'm I I because if I'm lying, I'll go back and I'll retract my statement. Because you could be driving anywhere, any fucking where it could be de- desolate, dead, it could be tumbleweeds coming. You look to your right, there is McDonald's. There is an arch right there. There is arch. It's like, oh, shit, they're going to McDonald's. Somebody put even in Africa. Yeah, yeah there's a McDonald's. Can I have a, I have a two-piece zebra burger? Well, you didn't like that? Okay. <laughs> Why are you being a mess? Though? Zebra good, though. <laughs> And this week I'll be having me a Big Mac and fries. Cuz I love a good Big Mac and fries. So so you you don't mind you don't mind the mystery meat that comes with McDonald's. No, I already know what's going on. <laughs> I already know. So nothing tells you like, you know what? Mo, since I found this out, I'm Mo, good. they've been up front with me for the longest. <laughs> I have watched horror videos of McDonald's. I have watched horror vid- not oh my god somebody said not make foo foo <laughs> really really <laughs> really is this what we're doing is this what we've become is this, this is most definitely <laughs> what we have become here make foo foo yeah thank y'all for that I need to write that down in my really book. thank you really <laughs> you, I guarantee you with me and you being the console I'm rolling it's um, I know it's gonna come up ah right, can I have a make foo foo please. <laughs> Double cheese. With extra cheese. <laughs> I don't want any pickles, please. No pickles. With extra foo-foo. Extra foo-foo, please. <laughs> McDonald's. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh McDonald's. You know, I should do that. Oh, McDonald's. I should, I should, I should. 
incorporate some African food. I'm telling you, we go. You know what? You know what, Mo? I see your vision. I'm gonna take this. You know, you know, because I got a, I got a cute little something coming. Uh huh. In July. Uh huh. <laughs> Cause it's been about a year. Mm. I had a cute little stuff coming. You're like, I think I'm gonna open up your McDonald's somewhere, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna motherfucking. <laughs> we're gonna incorporate the we're gonna incorporate, incorporate the African mo- food, the Mo's meal, <laughs> <laughs> McJala, McFufu. Oh, uh, 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 we can also have. A quarter, we can have Mick Goosey. <laughs> right. Oh, they put Mick Goosey. Mick Goosey. <laughs> can I have it a Goosey burger? Mick Goosey burger with it. <laughs> really? 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 That's what we do it? <laughs> Look, don't sleep on goat now. Goat is delicious. But you're right. There will be African... Hey, mama, where you going? Hey, girl, 